Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel, AKA Lily Works, and I am a mama and a reseller. And mostly I sell shoes, but I also sell jewelry. So we are here at the antique store with my four-year-old. Annalise, say hi. Um, and she brought her money. Can I count how much money you have? So I just grabbed, she just gave me her wallet with all of her money in there. So we're gonna count it to see how much she has to spend. Where, where are we, Annalise? At where? The teak store. The teak store. And what are we looking for today? Shoes. Are we looking for shoes? What else? Jewelry. Jewelry? Yeah. What else? Toys. Toys? Toys. <laughs> Alright, looks like you have five doll dollars. But you told me I need three. Well, no, I gave you three, but it looks like you have five all together. So you have five dollars to spend, okay? And what's gonna happen if you get a if you do a good job? I get a sticker. I have stickers in my bag. Whoa, stickers. All right, let's go head on in. Here you go. going to the vendor that I got the Napier cup from. Come on over here. Um, is it in here? Somewhere. But, ooh, look at all these glove clips. Right there. Because I paid a dollar for it and it sold for 83, so let's go see. So we're looking through these little pieces over here. We are close Okay, so this is 18, not the best prices, but nice butterfly. black glass. Yep, yeah, what is that, Annalise? It's a butterfly. What is it, though? Butterfly. It's called a brooch. What is this? Clip on earring. Are there two? There are two. These are really pretty, aren't they? Yeah, clip on earring. They're so pretty. How much are they? Mm, this looks like a leopard. Um, uh, they're all, Mom. all the tags are mixed up. Mom, this looks like a leopard. Wow. Okay, so we found the jewelry. I found that one Napier bracelet. What is this? Crown Tricari. This was four dollars. Two dollars. Two dollars. But you can't wear those because they're not clip-ons. What are they? They are hoop. Oh, this is not a piece of jewelry. I thought that was. Wow. Look how pretty this one is. A little yeah. mesh bow. Did it go on a wrist? Mm-hmm. Remember, you have five dollars. These are two. Ooh, look at these. I think we'll get these ones for two dollars. Watch. Yep, a watch. Look, there's stuff all down here too. If you see anything special, let me know. Okay. Look at these are some carved hoops for fifty cents. This sweet. What are those burgers? Little burgers. That's silly. Work. So I did grab some jewelry here. These ones in particular say something on the post. And then another pair in here. The swirly ones right there. Right there. Oh, they say sterling on them. So take those for three bucks. Which one? Not those exact ones. What is this? This is to get on your shoes. Oh. This one's pretty. Like a toggle. 
There's a big glass pendant. Oh, Mark. I'm gonna keep poking through here. India necklace. Alright, shoo! We're almost to the very top. Looks like there's clothes in this little area. Should we look in the purses real quick? Oh, there's a window here. Yep, we're way up high. Tell me when we can go downstairs. Five dollars. Let's see what brand this is. Let me try to open it. Bueno, so not waiting in Davis. Let's see if we can find any purses that we want. I think I found a red fossil purse here before. And belts. Found anthropology belts. And Fully beaded in Harley Davidson. What? That guy? Yeah. He's hiding? Yeah. Wow. Found it. So I am just going to check in the belt real quick. Let's see, what does this one say? This one again, my husband has this. It's where you can use it as a tool. K N Y has a nice buckle. Which one is for? So eight dollars. No sales today. This is really nice. I've sold purses like this before. Hey, hey, it what? Pays, it pays four dollars too. For what? This. What is that? I don't know. Are you excited about it? No, it doesn't look like something. <laughs> This one is. This is eight dollars for this clutch. It's really pretty though. I like that. Probably like India or Africa. Some boots down here. Lisa's is all excited about her finds over there. She's finding what prices mean. What? What's this right here? One dollar. One dollar. Look at this. Look at how neat this is. Little carved elephants. Yes, I do. And it's beautiful and it's a beautiful little brooch. See how much it is. Twenty dollars. It does say plastic. It actually looks like ivory, so don't think you can resell it. So they marked it as plastic, but I believe it's ivory. You can't resell ivory. <clears throat> mm hmm Where did you get that little... Oh, a dollar? <gasps> this is a score on Elise. Yeah, I just saw it. Oh my goodness, this one is your find. I love it. So good. It has a heart on it. Yeah. That was perfect. It looks like a little bean. Yeah. That one's a perfect one to buy. I love it. it? Yes. That's one. That's one really good one. Oh, this is literally my oh, mini me. <gasps> Are you excited? Yeah, okay. Show me. Oh, so adorable. Walked past these hats. And hats, vintage hats can sell. So let's see. $5 for a straw hat. No marks in it. Let's see this one. Nothing. So I am very confident with Annalise. To not break anything. She's a very, very careful girl. Right, Annalise?
Okay, so Annalise, what do you think about this little buffet? What? What you're, what you're holding. I think this might look good in Mama and Daddy's room to hold books. So that you guys don't pull down the bookshelf. I think it's pretty, like under our TV. So this is like more of like the furniture area where we're looking for a shorter bookshelf type of a thing. Ooh, and look at this purse. I like beaded purses. Oh, it's crumbling. Right there. Okay, no. Gloves. Wow. Oh, don't squeeze his nose. I know he's like a big squishy guy, isn't he? Cute. Do you see any jewelry? I see rosaries way over here. <gasps> we collect these banks for Gideon. Let's see how much these are. This one's 26. This one is 31. Looks like trick pony. And then what's that one? A monkey? Monkey bank? Cool, we might get one of those. Ooh, what's this right here? A pin. It says NJ1991. And it is $7.50. But it's like a cloisonne Egyptian pin. I might look this one up. This one's pretty cool. Yeah. Everyone how it works? Yep. This one we're gonna get for Gideon, the monkey bank for 30. 150. And then we're gonna look through these bangles and jewelry. I like it. You like that one? This one is like a an African fabric. Put a mirror in here. Hey, are we painting this? Yep. Oh, I wanted to show. This one is a leather and wood barrette, and that looks like a little amber stone. And this one is $7.25, but really pretty. Let's see. Three. There's sunglasses in here. Rose brooch. What does that pay? You mean cost? So this is the most gorgeous booth. My mom would love this. Let me see. Turn it around. Wow, okay, keep looking through those stickers to see which one's your favorite. This There's one's purses. My favorite. This one's my favorite. Okay. There's this gorgeous, giant tapestry needlepoint wicker basket right one. There. I think it's $19. I'm definitely getting that one. And then all these little hat fixings. My mom collects those, or she has in the past. Tons of, oh my goodness, look at that. So many neat things. Oh my gosh, look at this. $19, okay, we might grab this box bag right here. Yeah, and it's really well done, all the buttons. Then come over here, let's take a look at these vintage shoes. I'm gonna, I'm so gonna, pretty. hey, mom? Yes. I'm gonna <gasps> find more stickers that my favorite. Okay, go ahead. Look at this. What is this? I have my hands full of jewelry. It says something. Oh my gosh. This is so stinking adorable. Oh, something happens. Did it? Yeah. How much does it say? It says four dollars. I have four dollars. You might have four dollars if you really, really want that. Okay, let's keep looking. Mama's gonna keep looking through all these beautiful things. I found a crown trifari for three. I'm still looking because I find some really nice statement pieces if I just look. The 
like this one right here is really pretty. Let's see. All this art glass, there's no tag on it. This one has little fish. Sometimes bracelets will have the name on the button right there. Little charm, glass charms. It's mm, cute. What's this? This feels like a hair rubber band. And a watch. What does it say? Premier Designs. Huh. Three bucks for a Premier Designs watch. This is hey, like hey, hey, artisan. Hey, hey, hey. What? One, two, three, four. And what what about one in your hand? Oh, you're talking about to buy your ring? Yeah. Oh yes, you do have four. So this I believe is like the that silk that is wrapped around but wool. I I like I need, Indian silk. I, but I need I need a lot of money for something else. Belt with a floor to lee in there. Okay, let's see what. Can you show me your ring? Okay, look at what Annalise picked out instead of the brooch. I think this was a really good choice. Little glass beads. $1.75, and then she also picked some stickers. One. Two. Oh, I picked this one. Three. All right, so we are done shopping, and I wanted to show you some things that are notable that I'm going to be reselling. I did pay up for some things, but they're just things I love. I know I can make a decent profit on them, and so paid up. So this this one in particular. $19 and look at this it's like a lunch box but it is hand painted it is signed um where is it signed somewhere oh yeah Mimi right there and it is like metal it says 1960s purse there is a tiny bit of damage not on the front side but on the back side right there it's not that noticeable but as you can see there's two little Parts missing. Um, and then here's the inside. It looks like a handmade piece type of a deal, but so pretty. I'm gonna show you some of the other things I picked up from the store um, to resell as well. So here is this little wallet. Look at how beautiful this is. This looks like really antique, maybe like 20s and 30s, maybe, I'm not sure, but and then I think this was five dollars. So here is the wallet. It says Danielle de Perry. Danielle de Paris. Um so so pretty. All these little hand beads. Yes. Okay, next a glass bead bangle. This one was a dollar. And these are genuine black faceted beads. I got this one for $2. They are some shield screwbacks. So cool. They're not marked, but they're like a little shield crest with lions. This is a little Monet bracelet. Big chunky faux pearls. $2. These are some sterling screwbacks for three. And then when I got up to the register, um, the lady working the register was like, did you know these are 14 karat gold? And I was like, 
I knew they were something. She's like, I just wanted to make sure you knew that because I paid $2 for these and I saw that it was marked. If you see like a gold post on gold earrings, try to see if you can see any kind of little writing. Let's see if you guys would be able to see it at all. Very faintly. See what I'm talking about? Little tiny marks up there. It does say 14, 14K. I'm gonna have to look at it, make sure it's not like gold filled or anything, but still gold filled, two bucks. 14K, even better. <laughs> so that was exciting. This one, I'm just taking Mom. a, Mom. hold on a second, Annalise. This one I'm taking a chance on, two bucks. It's a Anson Titac. I, I do really well with some and then not so well with others. So it's kind of like I'm taking a chance. We have the Trifari. Um, let's see if it's Crown Trifari. Oh my garbage. No, you hold that. Oh, this is a Monet. Monet? Mm. Just $3. Mm. Then we have, let's take a peek at these. These are kind of cool. These look like carved feather plumes. They're purple and they were 50 cents. They're really neat. Let's take a peek. Little carved pieces. So thought those were kind of neat to grab. And then we have this. I'm not sure of the maker, but it is very, very well made. $7 again, taking a chance on it. But look at how pretty this little stone piece is here. And then we have this grayish blue stone, all stones and glass or stones. And then the clasp is super nice. There's the clasp right here. So I'm not sure if that is a maker's mark, but it is a magnetic clasp. Um, can't get that out. So really, really well made. It has to be something so looking forward to researching this so pretty and then two more little pieces here we have this one I can't read it um, but they're like little tiny clip-ons with the ena white enamel on the metal and I sold some that were similar to this no honey I sold something similar to this to England. Someone was a collector of Hattie something and it was like enamel over metal earrings. I'm not sure if that's what I'm seeing or it might be something else, but $2 for those. And then lastly in this little area, I believe this is a sterling, vintage sterling class. And then are these the snowflake oh, obsidian pieces? Um, I'm thinking so definite stone okay then we have this beauty look at this beautiful bamboo handle and needlepoint bit and it's really large so plus um <laughs> so beautiful $19 for this and I did stuff it so I'm, I'm gonna be listing this for at least like $99 probably um then we have this little egg-shaped tapestry. I think this one was five. There we go. Yeah, five. It does have some wear right there, but for five dollars, this is gorgeous. And is this the last piece? Oh no. You guys already saw this. The barrette. Little hair barrette. And then... I might do this in my whatnot show tomorrow, but it is a bag of jewelry for $12. And I did see that it does have matches of earrings. I do see like cloisonne. I'm hoping that there's a match of that one. There's these right at the top. These are some nice chunky clip-ons. Um, there's some new old stock, I guess. Ooh, I've sold this kind a um, few times where it, for their clip-ons, but they're like long, dangly, cha-cha, faux pearl, or AB. 
That's fun. What else? What is this? This is a big something. It's a wood piece. Not even sure what that is. Then you, it looks like you have a watch. Um, it has stars that move in the background. Hmm. See that? Doesn't say anything on the back. Nope, not that I can see. Little Pelly slippers. Ooh, here's a Lions Club brooch. So I've sold like Lion. It says Lion Inter Lions International. I've sold like rings, tie tags, blah blah blah. I'm sure this is something new that I found, so I can sell it for at least I don't know, ten bucks at least. So I do like grabbing things like that. That is not just junk. That they do have things for sale in here that I can definitely sell, especially if there's matches. This might be silver plated. It's like hollow, sterling silver plated. Uh, yeah, so super fun. Ooh, look at this little enamel swirl. Fun. A little butterfly. I know, super fun. There's that other clip on. Um, ooh, what honey? Are you hungry? Yeah. Okay, hold on. We're almost done. And then, ooh, look at this little Art Deco looking clip on. Clip on earring. Maybe the other one is in here. But, yeah, it looks like, ooh, what's this? Keep, I keep wanting to look at all of these. These are so much fun. What is this? A little crown trifari, possibly. I only see, like, I only see it says rifari, and like the T is very faint, so I don't know if there's a crown over it or not. But really pretty nonetheless. So basically, this pays for the whole bag. All right, so that is that. If you want to come to my whatnot show, or you did. And I posted this video later, yay. But I'm trying to do whatnot shows every 7 p.m. Central Standard Time. So go ahead and hit that link down below so you can join whatnot and come to the shows. Get some good reseller deals, deals for yourself if you're a collector, whatever. Do like on jewelry, jewelry, on jewelry, jewelry unboxings like that with me. I have two more Shop Goodwill boxes coming in the mail. So we're going to do that as well. So. If you like this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you like content like this. And we will see you guys next week. Make sure you guys are thrifting so you can live generously. Bye guys. Annalise, say bye.